super, super hydrated. Hey guys, it's Joe. Next up in the Glam Lab, I am breaking down a few moisturizing products that will help your dry skin and chapped lips get through the rest of the winter. Now, this episode is kind of like a love letter to Glam Lab. The first episode I ever did before we even called it Glam Lab was all about trying to help my skin in the winter. The second the season changes, I get these dry red patches all over around my mouth around my nose in that episode i did a seven day skincare challenge i did a detox and i tried all of these super hydrating moisturizing products to see if they could help that was four years ago four years thanks for watching all this time in those four years i've tried i don't know hundreds of products so here are a few awesome products that i loved after testing them out ahead of a localish deals and steals with tori johnson starting with the brand that you will actually already find in my skincare routine dr brand their wrinkle smoothing cream is light but still super moisturizing. It's specific to those expression lines where you start seeing the first sign of wrinkles. Like your crow's feet, your worry lines, basically anywhere I get my Botox. Also from Dr. Brand, their Pore Refiner Primer. It has a really creamy consistency, so it feels moisturizing on your face on top of your skincare, but it will still matte your skin so your makeup applies flawless. That really just glides on your face. I like it, my face feels very hydrated, smooth, silky. Another brand feature that has some pretty insane proven results is Strivectin. First up, the Crepe Control Body System. It comes with an exfoliating body scrub and a tightening body cream. I love that this is a system because I think we forget to exfoliate as much as we should. It really helps you shed that dead layer of skin cells so that new ones can regenerate. Another perk to exfoliating is it really helps with product absorption, which is where step two comes in with the body tightening cream. This stuff won't just really moisturize your skin, but it can visibly make your skin look tighter by increasing the elasticity. Next is the anti-wrinkle SD Advanced Plus Intensive Moisturizing Concentrate. This stuff targets 10 types of collagen. I thought there was just one. It's very thick, a little would go a long way. Next, the TL Advanced Skin Tightening Neck Cream. I feel like I started noticing more lines on my neck. If you've noticed that, screen time is a huge culprit. If you're sitting at a desk all day, looking down at a phone, you're laying in bed on your phone. It's like the equivalent to constantly crinkling your forehead. Honestly, I thought I could just take my face cream and just start applying it a little lower. Uh, but, spoiler alert, the skin on your face is different from the skin on your neck. Who would've thought? Right here. So I went with this award-winning neck cream. Pro tip, when applying neck cream, you are going from the bra line to the jaw line. Next, let's talk lips, because they suck in the winter. Dry, chapped, ugh. But this brand, Henne Organics, has an entire system for it. They've got a lip serum, a lip mask, and a luxury lip balm. Ooh, I love the packaging. The lip serum is really to help improve the appearance of the lines especially when they're all cracked and dry like that. But to really get the most out of this, you want to first use an exfoliant on your lips. It feels so good. It smells really good too. This is something I feel like would be great to do in the morning and then continuously apply your lip balm or your lipstick and finish with the mask. They say you should leave the lip mask on for at least 15 to 30 minutes, but I actually slept in it and um, my lips just woke up super soft. And speaking of a nighttime routine, I love this Retinol Rescue Overnight Cream from Clark's Botanicals. Retinol can yield amazing results for your skin, but it can also really dry it out, which is why I actually tend to stay away from retinol in my skincare routine during the winter months, until I found this. This cream is extremely thick, so it's going to make for a lasting moisturizer all night long. And another product I really like from this brand is their Jasmine Vital Oil. So cute. If you have dry skin, work in an oil. I feel like people are very hesitant to add oil into their daily routine. Maybe you just start with doing an exercise with it, like gua sha. I love using a facial oil with face roller or with gua sha because it doesn't pull at your skin, it just glides over. Final tip for that dry winter skin, body butter. It has a much thicker consistency than body lotion because it contains more oils, which helps deliver more nutrients to the skin. Body butter versus body cream. I love this one from Organic Bath Co because it's lavender, which has very relaxing properties. It smells like a spa in my bathroom. So those are a few hydrating products that will hopefully help your skin through the rest of winter. Whether you want to try them or not, at least I did, so you don't have to. 